Okay, so I caught the mama bird gone, and I'm just going to show you the babies real quick. If I can, it's really hard to see them. Um, they're down in there. There they are. Oh, they're brand new, little hatched out. We'll keep watching them, but I didn't want to try to film it with the mama bird here. So she's, I don't know where she's, must be out getting food or something. But um, I'll film them again in a couple of days. Hello everybody, it's Wendy, and today I have for you a new product showcase of some really cool stuff I got in for my website. I'm so excited about this stuff. So here is my information. There's my website. It's a bead on a wire jewelry.com. There's Facebook and Instagram. Um, I have a Facebook group that I've just started. It's called a bead on a wire sales and um, I'll link it in the description box below, but that is going to be where I sell um, some lots that I'm going to create with some gemstone pieces. Um, but my normal website is where all this stuff will be, and, uh, hopefully it'll definitely be up by the time I upload this video. <laughs> so, let's just get right into it. There's some really, really cool stuff in here. I was so excited to get this. It's a lot of metals, and I haven't had a lot of metals up on my site. So, first off are these really, really cute, um, turtle links. So, let me pull out a coin here. So, this is a nickel, and that's the size of the turtle. They are not double-sided, as you can see, but they are a link. It's not just a charm, and I thought they were so cute, this wave pattern. So that is one thing that's up there on the website. I'm going to go through it kind of quick because there's a lot. And then I have these turtle charms. Now these are not a link. They are just a charm, and they are not double-sided, as you can see. But look how cute they are. He has a lot of detail in him. Really, really cute. So that's number two. Then I've got these elephant pendants. Oh my goodness, I love this so much. Okay, so he's not double-sided, as you can see. But look at the detail in him. And he's got a place here for a, a, a rhinestone if you wanted to put like a, um, a chaton in there. And just the turquoise on him is so pretty. Now, it's not real turquoise. It's definitely synthetic turquoise. But just so you know, I don't have anybody yelling at me. But there he is beside the nickel. And I just thought he was so cute. And I can just see. Let me see if I have a chaton right here. I have one. This is a, let me see. This is a 19SS. So I would probably use, definitely, if I was going to put a chaton in there. Well, I don't know. Maybe I would use a 19. But. Yeah, there's what he would look like with a little 19SS purple velvet chaton. <laughs> so, really, really cute. I mean, you could do a lot with him. He's adorable. So, anyway, let me grab these out of the way. Okay, now this thing I actually bought for myself, but it's way too big for me. I'm too small framed <laughs> to wear this, but I loved it. I thought it was way smaller on the website. Oh, my goodness. Look at this bird. I thought it was so daggone cute. But yeah, I cannot. It's, it's, look how big it is. It's humongous. Um, somebody will love it. I don't, I know they will, but I only have the one. <laughs> and because like I said, I got this, I actually was going to keep it, but I thought it was so cute, but I did think it was much, much smaller. So just so you know, that's a big old one right there. And there's only one of those. And then these peacocks. Oh my goodness. I love these so much. I love these. They're so pretty. So, these are peacock pendants, and they have red and blue on them. Look how pretty. And that's him next to the nickel. He's big. He's a good size pendant, and they're not double-sided. But, oh, I thought it was so cool. I love these. I might have to order some more of these. They were really cool. Okay, and then I got these. Now, these I do love. I don't know why I love this big thing in this, but I didn't like the big thing in this. Maybe it was the difference in the shape. But look at these. Oh, these are gorgeous. And they're heavy, too. Um, you could put rhinestones all around that. You could do so much with this. You could patina it. It is not double-sided. But look at it next to the nickel. It is a good size pendant. It is so pretty. I absolutely love that. So I did get some of those. And then, um, hang on, I'm trying 
to save these little things for last because oh these i loved these are so cute they're cactuses aren't they adorable with the little turquoise in the middle of course it's synthetic turquoise it's not real don't anybody think that i'm trying to mislead you and there it is next to the nickel but it's not double-sided either but what a cute little charm i loved it so those will be up on the website as well. I thought that was so cute. Um, these are really cool. Now this, it said, imi excuse me, imitation amber. It doesn't look like amber. I don't know what, where they get that. But it is very pretty. It's like a resin stuff. But it's double-sided. And it's just a pendant. Or it could be earrings, I guess, if you wanted to. They're kind of big for earrings, I think, but maybe not. I don't know. But isn't that pretty? I love this. I thought that was so cool. So, so pretty. So, there's those. Um, and I have those also in this yellow shade. There that is. Isn't that cool? I don't know. It's got this shiny, sparkly stuff inside. Okay. And then I got some little, these are just little um, chandelier links. So, it's very tiny. It's not double-sided. Well, I guess it kind of is, if you want to consider that. <laughs> um, there it is against the nickel. So, they are tiny. But, I thought they were really cute. Little links or chandelier findings. So, I got some of those. Um, these are really cute. These are little Tree of Life links. Oh, aren't they sweet? They're not double-sided either. But I thought they were very, very cute. And there it is next to the nickel. It's not real big. <laughs> okay. And this I thought was really, really cool too. This is an arrow. It's an arrow charm. So I thought that was just super cool. It's not double-sided either. Now look at that. I loved it. It was so cool. That would make a really... It would actually be a pretty pendant even or earrings. Yeah. Love that. I was so excited when this came in the mail because I've been wanting to get some medals up on my site. More than just, you know, charms. Okay. This is a link. And I have no idea what's in the middle of it. I cannot tell. I think... Let me put my glasses on. I was trying to look at it earlier. I can't tell if it's a mermaid. I don't know. Honestly, I cannot tell what that is. Maybe it's nothing. Maybe it's just squiggles. But they're not double-sided either. But it is just a little link. There it is next to the nickel. So it's tiny. Oh, these I loved. They're in little... Sorry for the crinkle. Let me get them out of this package. I've already had this stuff out and taken pictures of all of it, but I haven't packaged it up yet. So this is the Sun, Moon, and Stars pendant. Oh, I love it. Isn't it pretty? So cute. No, it's not double-sided. There it is next to the nickel. So it's not huge, and it's not tiny. It's Really, it's a good size for a pendant, I think. But, oh, I thought it was so cute. So those are up there. Let's see what else I've got here. Oh, and these too. These little swirlies. I love these. It's a little swirly pendant. So it's really cool. See the detail in it. And there it is next to the nickel. So again, it's not huge, but not tiny. It's kind of a decent size. And these are really cool as well. These are like a, just a drop of charm, or it could be a pendant, it could be an earring. Really cute. And there that is next to the nickel. So they're not huge either. They're kind of a good size. Okay. And here is another tree of life. Well, I guess it's a tree of life. It's got a snowflake. It's fall, winter, summer, and spring. I thought these were just adorable. There it is next to the nickel. Love that. And 
here's a little chandelier finding. These are tiny and so cute. Okay. It's got like an Aztec design on there. And these are all holes that you could hang things from. There it is next to the nickel. Really cute. Okay. Oh, these Lampert butterflies, guys. Oh, these are so pretty. So these are pendants. They have a hole in them for the pendant, but isn't that gorgeous? And it's pretty good size. It's beautiful. I have waited forever for these to come. These have been on order forever. And I have this turquoise and blue. I've only got one of each. I wish I had more, <laughs> but I don't. The turquoise and blue. This orange and gold foil with a little turquoise in it. Aqua or something. Oh, they're so pretty. So there's that one. There is this black and white and gold one. Oh, they're gorgeous. And I think that's so cool that they have the thing, you know, you can hang them from. But there's only one of each of these. Okay, they're gone, they're gone. And I probably won't order more because it took literally months for them to get here. <laughs> And green and turquoise. This one's beautiful. Look at that. So there's those. Um, I got some more cats. These are different cats than the other cats. The other cats were like, um, I don't know, lighter color orange kitties. These are darker kitties. <laughs> but they're the same general. There he is next to the dime. Or the nickel. They're the same general look just a different color it's a darker kitty okay and oh these elephants my goodness when i saw these i was like these are adorable they are so so cute <laughs> look at these little elephant charms <laughs> aren't they adorable you could put a teeny tiny chaton right there in his eye like a pp i don't know 17 or 18 look how cute and he's little look at him and these are not double-sided, but oh my goodness, I thought he was so daggling cute. So the elephant. Now, I've got, let me grab something real quick. Okay, so I also have these pendants. These are opalite. They are beautiful. You can see that, look at that. They're not double-sided. But, oh my goodness, and look at, it's a good size. So there it is next to my nickel. Isn't that gorgeous, though? I've always been a sucker for opal. So, so pretty. So those are up on the site right now. I got some trees of life. I love this one. I think this one is so cute. Look at that. It's just a little pendant, or it could be, could be an earring finding. And so there that one is next to the nickel. Um, I ordered a bunch of Tree of Life stuff. I don't know. I just was in the Tree of Life mood that day. So here's another one. This one's really pretty too. There's the back of it. There it is next to the nickel. This one's cute. This one says, um, Mom, you're the heart of my family. So look how cute that is. What a great gift pendant for your mother. You could glue some chat, um, some leaf chatons in there, make them look like leaves. Really pretty. That's a good size one too. See. Okay. Um, and this one is not Tree of Life. It's just a pendant, but I love this. It's got. It looks like hearts to me. Isn't that pretty? There it is next to the nickel. And last but not least, this little tree of life. <laughs> it's just a little charm. It could be a chandelier finding. You could hang some things from there. And there it is next to the nickel. And okay, now here's the ones that I wanted to show you guys that I... Okay, so here we have this and this. <laughs> so... 
there it is. When you put it together with a head pin, it's a fish <laughs> with a bead in the middle. <laughs> is that not adorable? And I've got the head pin bent up just so it would stay on there because I was trying to take pictures of it. But obviously you would cut the head pin off. <laughs> but um, look at him. And that is a, I think it's, an, it's a 10 millimeter bead in there. He's so cute. So there's a fish. And then this one. So here's this part. I love these things for some reason. They just, and here's the bottom. <laughs> and it's a cat. Well, there it is. Little kitty cat. I think, anyway, I think it's a cat. Yeah, it's funny, but they're so cute. Maybe it's a fox. I don't know. Or a dog. I guess it could be a dog. I don't know what it is. But I love these, and that is a 12 millimeter bee. And then I have all of the, um, the teapots. I got more of all of the teapots, but then I got this different kind of teapot. So this is a fancier version. So there you have it. See that part? And then here, whoops, I'm not going to put this one on a head pin. I'm just going to show you, I think. Maybe not. Maybe I'm going to have to put it on a head pin. It needs a bigger bead. I've got a six millimeter. Let me get an eight millimeter bead and a head pin and I'll show you. Okay. These are really pretty. They're kind of a fancier version of the than the other one that I had on there, which I got more of those in. So here we go. Put this here. Put your Yeah, it definitely needs an eight millimeter bead. But look at that. Isn't it cute? And I only have these in silver, this fancier version, but I do have the other one in gold and silver. But, yeah, I thought those were so adorable. So, let me see if there's anything else. Of course, I've painted lucite flowers like mad. I've got a bunch more of the lucite flowers up on the site. Here's an example of one of them. Whoops. Oh, my goodness. Can't hang on to anything today. Here's an example of one of them. They're beautiful. Look at that. They turn out absolutely stunning. I love these. So, those are teal and yellow. Um, and I've got all different colors of them. Literally, I mean, I have got every color in the, of the rainbow, it seems like, up on the website. Here's an orange and yellow, which is really pretty. There they are. So, they look like stained glass when you're finished. They're just beautiful. Um, and these are what I've used to make. This one's not painted, but this is one of the earrings that you can make with them. This flower is not painted. I have to. Actually, when I made these, I made the dangles longer on this one than the other one, so it's got to be fixed. That's why it's laying here. And here's another one. This is just a black one. But these are just examples of what you can do with those lucite flowers. They're beautiful. And when you do the stained glass ones, they're really, really pretty. So I think that's everything new. Um, like I said, the gemstone lots are coming. They're on their way. I've got a bunch of um, leather. Let me show you guys this. If I can get it under the camera here. Faux leather. Check it out. I have been cutting faux leather for days. Look at this. And no, ladies and gentlemen, I did not do this on a Cricut. I hand did. hand cranked all of this. I tried the Cricut. The Cricut is horrid. I hate it. It will not cut. It messes my leather up every single time. It bunches up in there and um get stuck and i just despise it i mean every time i've used it i've been so mad i've been ready to cuss and i don't cuss so that says a lot right there but um here's some that i embossed and these are some flowers it's just um now i know these don't match but this is just an example of what you can do to make your rings you just poke, poke a little hole um but i have tons of this guys i've got tons of um, different shapes and tons of different um, patterns and it's all going to be put into little lots and I'm going to um, I don't know if I'm gonna I mean I will color code it I'm not sure exactly how I'm gonna do the lots but look here look what a cute little faux leather earring that would make right there if you just glue this flower on this one put a little hole in the top there and hang it from a fish hook and what a cute little earring so anyway, all this will be um, into lots. 
and up on the website probably not by the time I get this video out but um, because this is gonna take me a long time but um, yeah all the other stuff will definitely be up on there but look they make such pretty earrings so anyway um, that is what I was doing all yesterday evening and my arm is actually sore today I cranked that thing so many times so oh there was one more thing I wanted to show you guys okay so I do have three more Lampwork glass butterflies these are different than the other ones and I ordered a bunch of these and almost all of them came broken I was so upset so um, I only have a few left here's one these are really really pretty it's got the bail for the pendant Here's what the back looks like so I've only got three of these <laughs> so I only have one of the others and well one of each of these but there's three different colors but yeah they came broken and I was so so sad about that because they're so pretty look at them and then there's a blue and red this one would have been really good for 4th of July Get it out. there we go so yeah aren't they beautiful but yeah, there's only one of each of those as well. So anyway, I think that's everything. When the gemstone lots arrive, um, I will sort them and, you know, package them up. And then we'll have our event on Facebook. And I'm excited about it. But um, all this stuff will be up on the website, like I said. Except for the faux leather, which is probably going to take me a few days to get that organized. But everything else will be up there. And, um, yeah, so I'm going to get to work right now uploading it all so I can upload this video. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.